Welcome to the Dolls House Emporium and thank you for choosing your quick style kit. My name's Mark and I'm Jenny and today we're going to show you exactly how you go about building your quick style house. This is how it will arrive at your doorstep and we're going to show you how to build it, aren't we Jenny? That's right. So, step one. Jenny, what's the first thing we need to do when we open our box? As soon as you receive your box, you need to unpack it and take out all the parts. We haven't got all the parts of the kit here, but these are the main items that the kit includes. All the panels, the windows and door, which are all pre-painted for you, staircase, chimneys and your instruction leaflet. And it is important to check your instructions to make sure that all your parts are here. But if you do have any problems, help is only a phone call away and everyone you speak to on the phone will have built at least one doll's house themselves. Oh, so they'll know exactly what you're talking Absolutely. about when you get stuck on the yes. stage or anything like that. So the first thing is we lay everything out, check out that we've got everything in the box that's all complete. Now I just have to ask you, what is a quick style kit? What does that mean? Well, quick style is something we've introduced quite recently and it means we've taken out all the hard work for you. All the external decorating is done. There's no painting or decorating of the outside at all for you to worry about. All right, so all these come painted it exactly come like this. It coloured as you see it, as it is in the catalogue for you. Your windows and doors are all pre-painted, oh, so excellent. that saves you loads of time. And your staircases are pre-painted, so it's saving you a huge amount of time and you can get professional results really quickly and easily. That's fantastic. But if you did want to do this yourself, you could always go and have a look at our collector's kits where you can actually paint everything from scratch, can't you? That's right. That will give you the option if you want something a bit more individual or if you enjoy the more creative process of decorating the outside yourself. But in the meantime, we're going to try and That's put one right. of these together, aren't we then, Jenny? Step three. OK, Jenny, what are we going to do now? What we're going to do next, Mark, is what we call a dry build. And this is our way of just making sure that we totally understand the instructions and we're happy with the positioning of every part of the kit. So a dry build means we don't use any glue? There's no gluing involved at this stage. It is literally just placing them in position and then holding everything in place with masking tape. OK, well, I'll put this side panel on then. You put yours in. OK. I'll hold that for you. All right, and I'm going to slot in the back panel. Oh, now, I noticed something on that back. There's a, like a little disc or something. What's, what's that? That's right, Mark. Well spotted. This is the Dolls House Emporium logo. It's an enamel badge that's set actually into the back of the kit. And this means that this is a genuine Dolls House Emporium kit. No other companies can offer that. You'll only be buying a pure Dolls House Emporium product when you see that logo on the back. So that's a good sign, isn't it? It a good is, seal. yeah. It's very Reassurance important. is what it I like to say. It is very important. Yeah. It's a status symbol with your Dolls House to have that logo on there. So now all you're doing is put an ordinary masking tape on. That's right. And that just holds that in place. Just hold it in place and then as you work through the instructions and gradually add the different pieces, you will see the shape of the house just appear before your eyes. Simple. That's right. Step four. Now a very, very useful piece of advice here. We have still got the house with the masking tape on. We've not started gluing it yet. Jenny, what are you going to tell me? That's right. It's a very quick but very important piece of information that will save you loads of time. When you're building your doll's house, you must remember to paint or decorate the inside of these hallways before you fit the staircase. So I'm sure you can imagine, once that staircase is in place, it's practically impossible to cut the wallpaper around it. That's good advice. Step five, and as you can see, our house is beginning to take shape. Now, we've glued all this, haven't we, Jenny? That's right, everything's glued into place, following the simple instructions. And again, I've secured all the panels in place with masking tape, and I will leave it to dry overnight to make sure everything's firmly in place before I move on to the next stage. Now this looks exciting because this is the front panel, so this is the house starting to take real this shape. This is the most exciting bit because this is the part you will see all the time. And everything is in the kit that you need. You've got all your doors and windows, everything's pre-cut, 
and you'll find that the windows are a perfect fit they just drop straight in now you're going to glue this with what What's it's just this is just the normal pva glue that comes in the kit okay so what we used on the house then Same that's thing. right yeah. it's wood glue there is plenty of it so don't worry about running out and i'm just applying it lightly around the grooves of the window and this is my last one now and as soon as that's in you'll see that we've got a perfect finish very quickly and very easily and again, you just let that set overnight, overnight, and then we're ready to add it to the front of the house. That's right. This is getting exciting now. I can't wait to see the finished no, thing. we're nearly there. And now the grand finale. Come on, Jenny, I want to see it. The house is now finished. What does it look like? Just wait until you see this. This is fantastic. Come on. Here it comes. Let's have a look at this. Oh, my words, that is fantastic. What a great job you've done of finishing off the front. Where have all these accessories, these flowers come from? That's right. I've had a good look through the Doll's House Emporium catalogue and I've found some window boxes and flowers for around the front door to make a really great first impression. They look terrific. And what about the furniture and the fixings and the lighting inside? Everything you see is available in the catalogue or at dollshouse.com. And we do have some masterclasses on the furniture and the fixtures and fittings coming up very shortly. Now, is this the only quick style house I can choose from? No, Mark, there's plenty. There's all shapes and sizes and there's something for every taste. And here are just a few for you to choose from.